take a look at this. A goldfish invasion. Now, this isn't someone's backyard. It's in a Boulder County pond. Yeah, what probably started as a few pet fish dumped into the pond turned into thousands. And Jacqueline Allen is finding out the goldfish are taking over. Yeah, the signs here at North Tello Lake talk about the fragile habitat here. Now, you may be thinking goldfish seem pretty harmless, though, right? Well, here they're an invasive, non native species, and Colorado Parks and Wildlife wants them out. From a distance, this Boulder County Lake may look like any other. Walk a little closer. Oh, there they are. Just underwater is an invasion. There they are, in all their glory. There's like gazillions of them. You can see all the orange in the reeds. Look at them all. Most of them are orange or some white, black and white, black and orange. North Teller Lake has become a giant goldfish bowl. It's extraordinary. Colorado Parks and Wildlife says the invasion started a couple of years ago, probably with someone dumping about four goldfish. Now it's 4,000. You can see them all over the place. I mean, they definitely didn't, didn't waste any time in reproducing in these crazy numbers. Jennifer Churchill with Parks and Wildlife says the pet fish is upsetting the natural balance, draining resources for native fish and birds. It won't take long for it to really ruin the fishery. It's part of a larger issue, people dumping pets without considering the impact. In 2012, thousands of koi were taking over Thunderbird Lake in Boulder County. Parks and Wildlife used electroshocks to stun the fish and remove them. Now they may do the same thing here, or they may have to drain the entire lake. They could be taken to other waterways as well, and so this could spread. And that's certainly something we don't want to see. We don't want to have uh, goldfish throughout the South Platte. They're huge. They're so big ones. Word is spreading fast, though, about the invasion, or maybe about the catch of the day. And we've got a perfectly good pond to put them in, and rather than go buy them at PetSmart, why not, right? And you can see here, fishing is allowed here, but to be clear, Boulder Open Space and Mountain Parks does not want people coming out here to remove these goldfish. They say it could disrupt the natural environment. There is no timeline yet, though, for the goldfish removal. Uh, Boulder, uh, the Colorado Parks and Wildlife says they will be given as food to a local raptor rehabilitation program. Reporting live, Jacqueline Allen, 7 News.